Hello, Osmin. Hello, uh, teacher. How are you? How are you? I am. I am fine. Thank good. you. Good, good, good. I'm doing okay. I'm in the office. Um, not in not in my house in the office no no in my office you are I, in your office you are in your office yes i am in my i am in my office good you go to your house at 8 a.m exactly tomorrow tomorrow yes okay good What's today's date, Osman? Uh, Friday. Friday. Well, Friday, 12th well, of January. January or February? Which one is correct? Excuse uh, me, February, yes. February. And what's the year? The uh, year is uh, 2021. Excellent. What time is it now? Now my clock twenty oh five. Twenty oh five. Very good. Very good. Yes, twenty oh five. Very good. Do you remember the topics we covered yesterday, uh, Osmin? Mm, a little uh, over, over uh, the clock. How the clock? Uh, the time. Hi, okay. Yeah. The time. Okay. How do you say las ocho y seis? Um, eight or six. Eight or six. That is correct. Good. Excellent. Okay. Hello, Rose. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Hi, thank you. Good. How was your you? day? I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. Okay. Yes. How was your day? Where are you? I'm in the office. Uh, I'm in the office. What? Because uh, Friday. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you see, the thing is that uh I went to Zacatecoluca today and, and, I, and I came back to San Salvador around 5 p.m. Oh. So 5 p.m. Los Chorros, not a good idea. It's so difficult. So I came to the office and, uh, and decided to stay here. Okay. Yep, yep. So that's the story. That's why I'm here. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, do you remember the topics we covered yesterday, uh, Rose? In a few words, we are talking. We are talking about how how to say the hour. Yeah. Yes. How to tell the talking, time. Ah, how to tell the time. We're talking about time. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Good. What is another form to say fifteen minutes? What? Quarter. Another another form to say 30 minutes? Half hour. Half hour. Good. Yeah. How do you say la una y cinco? One o five. One o five. That is one correct. One o five. Yes. Five. One o five. That five. is correct. Yes. All right. So let's begin. It's eight o eight in this month. Yeah, it's too late. <laughs> yeah, so I finished the class at 10 p.m. and I'm going running to my house. Yeah, you have to be careful. Yeah, especially Fridays, you know, people are outside drinking, yeah. doing yes. things. Yeah. But we'll see. Janet, how are you, Janet? I find you. I'm doing okay, thank you. It's good to have you in class. Thank you. Good, good, good. Janet was missing yesterday, no? Yes, yes she was. She was uh -huh, missing. Ah, Janet. 
Janet was on vacation. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. No, este, the, I, I sleep. What? You sleep? I sleep late on the, I sleep, I sleep come late. Oh, you left ah. work late. I left. I left. I left. Come late. Work to my house because. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Vilma, how are you? I stay late. Bye. It's good to have you back, Vilma. What? It's good to have you back. Ahí lo vamos a poner. It's good to have you back. It's to have you because we didn't see you. Exactly. It's good to have you back. Yes. All right. So let's begin. Uh, let me see this here. Uh -huh. So we go here. Yesterday we finished this chart. Yes. And now we start with these prepositions that are very, very important. In, on, at. Can you see my book? Yes. All right. So these are prepositions of time. These are prepositions of time. So please pay attention to my um, book. We have on, we have in, and we have at. If you will mention how many days are there in one week? Seven. Seven. Si usted menciona cualquiera de los siete días, usted tiene que decir on. What is the typical day when Salvadorians go to church? On Sunday. On Sunday. On Sunday. Very good. On Sunday. Good. So, si va a mencionar el mes más la fecha, tiene que decir on. When is Mother's Day in El Salvador? On May 10th. On May 10th. That ten. is correct. On May 10th. Yes. If you were if you're going to mention the day plus the month and the date, you say on. If you will mention the day plus the part of the day, you need to say on as well. How do you say el martes en la tarde? On Tuesday afternoon. Exactly. On Tuesday afternoon. Okay. That is correct. Any questions with the first one? No. No? Okay. So, fíjese bien. Ahorita vamos con in. Si va a mencionar solamente el mes, usted va a decir in. When is Christmas? Which month? In December. In December. Very good. When is Independence? In September. In September. Okay. So listen to my example. How do you say yo nací? I was born. I was born. I was born. Recuerde lo que les dije. El verbo nacer es el único verbo en inglés que para conjugarlo al tiempo pasado usted debe de poner el verbo to be. Entonces, how do you say nacer in English? Born. 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 Si usted quiere decir nació o nacieron, usted debe decir was born or were born. Were born. De forma obligatoria usted tiene que ponerle was or were. So, entonces, yo le digo, 
I was born in 1971. I was born in 1971. When, when did we become independent from Spain? Cuando nos hicimos independientemente de España? In 1921. Not exactly. Not exactly. In qué año? Ah. November. Okay, November 5th. Oh, yes. But, but, pero ese es el primer grito de independencia. Mm -hmm. Which year? ¿En qué año? Juan A21. Juan A18. Juan A18 is correct. So. Okay, is, is what. Mm, how do you say? In um, 1821. Yes, 1821. In 1821. Exactly. Yeah. So look here. Because, because this year we we're going to celebrate 2,000 years. 2000. 200. 200. 200. 200. 200. Exactly. 200 yes. years. Okay. Now, the day has morning, afternoon, and evening or nighttime. What is your favorite part? Mm. So remember, morning. okay, morning, afternoon, and evening, you need to say in. In mm -hmm. the morning. In the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Ahora bien, si usted va a decir una hora específica, you need to say at. What time is your English class? At 8 p.m. At 8 p.m. What is the meaning of noon? Mediodía. Mediodía. Yeah. What time is your lunch? At 12. At 12. Uh, what is another uh, form uh, to say 12? Noon. At noon. noon. At yeah. noon. What time is the concert? At night. At night. And what's the meaning of midnight? Medianoche. Medianoche. What is another form to save midnight? 12 p.m. 12 a.m. 12 a.m. 12 a.m. 12 a.m. 12 a.m. That is yeah. correct. 12 a.m. 12 a.m. All right. Any questions or comments? So, in the States, there are four seasons. There are four seasons. What are the names of the four seasons? ¿Cuáles son los nombres de las cuatro estaciones en inglés? Winter, spring, summer, and fall. Okay. Winter, spring, spring summer, summer, and four. And four. Ahí están las cuatro estaciones en Estados Unidos. ¿Qué dijimos acerca del clima en El Salvador? ¿Tenemos temporadas? ¿Tenemos estaciones? Two. Yes or no? Only two. Only two. Ok, two what? Um, how do you say the how do you say what? Uh, you say uh, dry dry season. No. Period. Oh, dry period and what? What? No. And the rainy period. Ah, the rainy period. Okay. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. ¿Por qué es que, ¿Por qué es que no tenemos estaciones en El Salvador? Mm. Vilma, Jessica, you're back. Period. It's good to have you back, Jessica. A ver, la pregunta va para todos. ¿Por qué no hay estaciones en El Salvador? It's a tropical country. Excellent. Tropical weather. Uh, weather. 
Yes, tropical weather. Entonces, cuando hay uh, clima tropical, el, el clima es el mismo todo el año. So, ¿Qué entiende usted por invierno? ¿Qué será la definición de invierno? For us, it's raining. Rain. Ajá. In other places? In other places, uh, invierno, winter, winter. Winter is when it is uh, cold. It's not cold. Winter. Cold. Yeah, it's cold. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So, usted puede ver, eh, digamos, New York, ahí neva. La temperatura drops, cae. Y cae tan bajo que la gente se muere. People die. So, um, entonces, ¿por qué le estoy mencionando estos cuatro? Porque en el libro le ponen como ejemplo in the summer. Pero así como ponen summer, puede ser winter, spring, fall, and so on. Any questions there? But here we use summer. Excuse me? The word. Here, here in Salvador, we use the word summer. Yeah, yeah. Summer vacations. Yes. And the Holy Week, we say it's the summer. Yeah. Yeah. Sí, como la, 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 en, en Holy Week, en la Semana Santa, la temperatura sube. Uh -huh. Pero igual siempre es parte de la, del dry period, yeah, del periodo period. seco. Yes. Very, very hot. Very hot. <laughs> Extremely hot. Yeah. Hay años que, que, que se pone como que esto está uno bien caliente. True. Okay, any questions or comments? Questions, questions? No? Okay, so le vuelvo a repetir. Cuando usted va a decir un día, dice on. Cuando va a decir el mes más la fecha, va a decir on. Si va a decir el día, el mes y la fecha, va a decir on también. Si va a decir el día más la parte, Puede ser morning, afternoon, evening. También va a decir on. ¿Estamos bien aquí, clase? Yes. Ok. El in, aquí solo menciona el mes. Solo menciona el año. Solo menciona la temporada. O solamente menciona la parte del día. Y cuando decimos at, es porque está diciendo... Cualquier hora en específico. Cuando está diciendo al mediodía, cuando está diciendo de noche, cuando está diciendo de medianoche. Any questions? Preguntas. ¿Estamos bien? Are we okay? Yes. All right. So, vamos a... A ver, ¿dónde es que está este ejercicio? Right here. Vamos a ver, excuse me, excuse me. Okay, can you see the document? Yes. Okay, fíjense bien. Aquí este está un poco más extendido. En la noche, a las diez y media, at noon, at midday, at midnight. At bedtime, at sunrise, at sunset. Y en el UK, what's the meaning of UK? In the United Kingdom. United Kingdom. Y en el Reino Unido, cuando dicen el fin de semana, dicen at the weekend. Mm -hmm. okay. Any questions about this vocabulary? Si no preguntan es porque ya se lo saben todos. Entonces yo les voy a preguntar a ustedes. A ver, a ver. What is bedtime? Uh, bedtime? Uh, bedtime. 
Bedtime. Oh, bedtime es hora de dormirse. Dormir. Ah, okay. Bedtime. 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 What time is your bedtime, Janet? Maybe uh, 10, 30. Okay. Good. What is your bedtime, Rose? At around? At uh -huh. around. Yeah, at around. At around, at around 12. 12. Midnight. Midnight. That's late. Yes, I have to do many things. I imagine. <laughs> I imagine. What time are yes. you up? What time do you wake up? At, at 5 a.m. Yeah, um, but I imagine that you rest on the weekends. Uh, yes, I take a nap on Saturday, uh -huh. and and I take a nap on Sunday too. Good, good, very yes. good. A little, a little naps about a uh, half a, half hour. Uh huh. Yes, but good. my daughter my daughter take a nap about three hours, <laughs> and I oh, say that, that's not a nap. <laughs> uh, yes. That's not a nap. <laughs> <laughs> You're sleeping. <laughs> yeah, she's sleeping. <laughs> okay, good. All right. Alguna pregunta en at? What's the meaning of sunrise? Sunrise. The, uh, when the sun is rise. <laughs> uh, uh, when, the, when the sol empieza a aparecer. Yes. Do you, I don't know. Yeah. yeah, at the beginning of the day. <laughs> at the beginning of the day, for example, Today, the sunrise was very amazing. Really? I I saw a sun orange, orange, made orange, yes. It, uh -huh. it has a color, it has a beautiful color. Good, good. I love it, I love it, yes. Nice, nice. Mm -hmm. So, la parte dos is in. In the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, in February. En este ejemplo ya no ponen summer, sino que ponen spring. Summer, fall, autumn, in the winter, el año, la década, y en un par de minutos. Are we okay with in? ¿Estamos bien con in clase? Why the parentheses? Uh, a few minutes. Eh, en algunas ocasiones es... Um, Es opcional decirlo. Entonces, por eso lo ponen en paréntesis. Ah, ok. In a few minutes or in a minute. In a minute, exactly. Ah, or okay. in a few, or a few minutes. minutes. Right. Ah, right. it's right. It's like the in the spring. Ok, yeah. In the spring ah. or in spring. In spring. Ah, okay. uh -huh. Good. Okay. ok, y de ahí tenemos on. On Sunday, on Monday morning, on Tuesday afternoon, on Wednesday evening, on my birthday, on a holiday. Can you give me examples of holiday? Vilma, can you mention one example of a holiday? Vilma, what, can... what holiday? Any holiday, any holiday that comes to your mind. ¿Qué holiday se puede? Mm -hmm. ¿Cuáles son los holidays en El Salvador? Mother's Day. Father's Day. Mother's Day. Yes, on Mother's, Mother's Day. Day. On Father's Day. How do mm. you say Día del Niño in English? <gasps> oh. Nice. On Children's Day. Children's Day. Children's Day. Uh-huh. Dia de los Muertos in English. Guys. Die. Not exactly. <laughs> um, I forget it. Dive's Day. Ahorita se lo pongo. Now, wait a minute. Ahí está. 
Yes. Oh. Soul Soul's day. day. What's the meaning of soul? It's alma. Soul. Alma, el día de las almas, exactly. Oh, Soul's yeah. day. When do we celebrate Soul's day in El Salvador? Mm, second day of November. November. Excellent. November. The second November. day of November. November 2nd. Okay. November 2nd. Okay. All November 2nd? Yes, yes. all November yes. 2nd, exactly. Okay. okay. Now, in El Salvador, sometimes uh, you get November 1st also free. También le dan el primero de noviembre libre. ¿Por qué será? In my case, no. Ok, pero en algunos lugares piden el primero o le dan el primero. ¿Por qué será? Si yo estoy aquí, on the, on the, on the government. Ajá. Me digamos, yo estoy aquí en San Salvador y si mi familia es de la Unión, ¿qué tendría que hacer? Desplazarme un día antes. Ah, ok, yes. Uh -huh. so por eso le dan el, 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 el extra day. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's for transportation. Ok. Y aquí aparece, uh, no, no es este. Wrong. Um, es este de acá. So, uh, holiday, Christmas Day, May 5th. ¿Se acuerdan del 5 de mayo? ¿Qué se celebra el 5 de mayo? En México. Ajá. Es el día del primer... Ay, ay, el primer grito, no. Mm, el grito de exact. algo, ¿no? ¿no? No, no recuerdo. Fue cuando los mexicanos vencieron a las tropas francesas. Mm. Y para ellos es una gran cuestión, pues, y lo es, pues. Entonces, y curiosamente se celebra más en Estados Unidos que en México. Con la comunidad de los chicanos y todo eso. I remember, I remember my, 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 May 5th. May 5th. May 5th. Uh, because in the movie, The Speakable Me, uh, they celebrate. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cinco de Mayo, right. Yeah. It's a Mexican-American important tradition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, any questions? ¿Cómo ocupar el in on at en los tres cuadros de arriba? No. Vamos a ver. A ver, a ver. Si puede tomarle un screenshot, please do it. Hágale un screenshot. In on at. ¿Estamos listos para el primer ejercicio en pareja? Yes. Ok, so let me, los voy a poner a trabajar en Another room. And here we go. de pantalla fíjese que estoy trabajando en un iPhone muy, muy reducido y no, y no pude Creo que a, a, agarraron, la, agarraron la pantalla yo en el caso no pude sí, quiero la agarró y con el de vamos a trabajar ok, entonces si la pueden si la, si la agarraron, si la puede compartir en uh, en el chat ok Ahí está ahorita. ¿La pueden ver ahorita? Sí. 
Ahorita sí. Sí, estoy bien. Okay. Me voy a levantar un momento. Give me a second. Okay. Okay. Jessica. Okay, la primera sería, bueno, la segunda sería sería um. Quiero ver este eh, eh, va a ser la afternoon. Vaya, la segunda sería. Ajá, esta es la primera. La sí, primera. en la segunda. Sí, tiene razón. We going to have a picnic on con cuando es el día, mes y año es on, correcto. Sí, on. Uh -huh. sí, está bien. En la segunda sería. En la segunda, que la primera. I be finish my work. En este caso. Pero esto es en In how. In. In. In sería. Sí. Cuando se refiere a. a... Lo, voy a lo voy a ir anotando. Sí. Dijimos que la dos, oh, la tres, in October, yes, in October, okay, eleven. The cafeteria opens for lunch at noon. At noon? Yes, at noon. Well, what time you're so good to bed? I'm not going to watch TV. I not I'm not going to watch TV. No. <laughs> I'm not going to watch that TV show. Show. It starts at midnight. At midnight. Mm -hmm. 15 is out. Wow. We are very fast. Yes. <laughs> okay, um, we have and now curious and fast. <laughs> fast and furious, fast and furious. Yes, fast and furious. More, more, more furious than fast. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, we have to read all the sentences. Yes. Yes. Okay, you first, uh, Janet. All sentences. Yes. Mm. Ahí sí no recuerdo, pero nada. 
La ocho. ¿Cuál están haciendo? Which number are you doing? Eh, will we be? Number eight. We, will we be? Yes. What will we? Will we? Will we be? Will be we what? Fine.
All right, all right. See this here. We're still missing Osmin, Vilma, and Janet. Okay, Osmin is back. Janet is back. All right, everybody's back. All right, can you guys hear me? Yes. yes. Okay. Uh, Jessica, what is the answer for number two? Jessica, Jessica. Hola. Yeah, what we, is the answer? Uh -huh. We're going to have a picnic on Saturday afternoon. Uy, no veo lo demás. Would you like Would to you come? Would you like to come? Excellent. Very good. Very good. Osmin, what is the answer for number three? Okay. 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 The number three, I will be finished. Finish my work in an hour. In an hour. In an hour, okay. Then I can go home. Excellent. I'll be finished my work in an hour. Then I can go home. Good, very good. What is number four, Rose? Four. When is the meeting? It is at two o'clock. Is it a question or an answer? Oh, sorry. When is the meeting? It is at two. Is it at two? Is it at two? Okay, good, good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Vilma, do you have number five? I like to get a rail, a uh, rail. Early in sorry when the birds birds to sing. When the birds start to sing, I like to get up really early. In, on, or at Vilma. In at sunrise. At sunrise, when the birds start to sing. ¿Qué dice la última parte? Los pajaritos empiezan a cantar. Exactly. All right. Janet, what is number six? Six is Tom's birthday in the next week on January 14th. Excellent. 14th. Tom's birthday is next week on January 14th. Very good. Osmin, do you have number seven? Okay. My grandfather was born, born in the 1950s. Ah, okay. In the 1950s. In the 1950s. Yes. Number eight. Jessica, do you have number eight? Will be, will we be? Will, will we be on time or will we miss our fleet? Flight. Excellent. Will we be on time? Or will we miss our flight? Yes. Very good. Number nine. Volunteer for number nine. My family and I. My family. My family. Uh, and I like to ski. Ski? Ski. To ski in. Good. Good. Okay. In winter. Very good. Very good. Okay. Number 10, another volunteer. Are there any holidays? Are there any Are holidays there? in October? In October. On Very October. Good. In October. In October. It's on. In. In what? October. Oh, yeah, yes. It's a month. Yes, yes. Exactly. Yes. In October. Yes. 
Yes. Huh? Yes. Okay. Okay. What about 11? Our cafeteria, our school cafeteria opens for lunch? No. What is oh, the we answer? Have, we have... Um, at, at noon. At noon. Good. Number 12. What time does your son go to bed? At night. At night. At night. What time does your son go to bed at night? Uh huh. Jessica, do you have number 13? Yeah. We moved to the city in 2012. When did you move, Jessica? How do you say 2012 in English, Jessica? I don't know. 2012. 2012. Very good. And now we can say 2021. Yes. Sure. Yes, you can uh -huh. say 2021 or 2021. The two options are good. But uh, but here we can say 2012. 2012, yes. Yeah. Yeah, uh -huh. you can say 2012 or 2012. 2012. Uh -huh. yeah, the two options are good. Okay. What about 14? Are you going to do anything special? In your birthday. Uh -uh. It's on yeah. your birthday. Uh, we on have, your we birthday. Have okay. On your birthday. Yes, mm. if I show you the, the previous thing, you say on, and then you say my birthday. Ah, okay. Okay. Because in the word in the in the book uh, we have, uh, I on is for month or day, but in this case, birthday. Yeah. Right. This document is it has has more information than the book. Mm -hmm. Okay. It has more information than the book. Okay. All right, it's and 15, on. I'm not going to watch that TV show. It starts at midnight. At midnight. At midnight. At midnight. That is correct. Any questions or comments, people? Preguntas, preguntas? No? Okay, so let's Continue. Let me share this with you. And here we are. Can you see my book? Pueden ver mi libro? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. How do you say arroba in English? At. At. Very good. How do you say guión bajo in English? Okay, let me write it for you. Ahí tenemos arroba. We say at. Guión bajo. Underscore. Underscore. How do you say guión? A ver, vamos a ver. Who remembers? Hola. Gion. Gion. How do you say Gion in English? Check your classes. Okay. Your previous classes. Yes. Yes. In, in. There is a mass in my book. <laughs> okay. Ahí está en el chat. Meeting everybody. Dash, dash or hyphen. Yes. Dash or hyphen. Okay. Algún otro signo que lleve su email y no le he puesto ahí. Okay. 
No. Okay. So look here. I need a volunteer to read the instructions on part five. Okay. Go ahead. My air using the position of time compare compare answer with a classmate. Good compare answers with a classmate. Okay. Who is sending the email? ¿Quién está enviando el correo? A ver quién me puede leer ese correo electrónico. Rose, you want to try? Yeah, Fatty. Fatty, uh, 2018. Yes. Okay, Fatty, 2018 at email. Dot com. Excellent. No. no. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, excellent. <laughs> email. Okay. Fatty, uh, okay. Fatty, Fatty 2018 at email. At email dot com. com. Okay. Dot com. Okay. Jessica, ¿me puede decir the second email? ¿Quién, yeah. va, ¿Quién va a recibirlo? Mari underscore two at email.com Excellent. Mary underscore two at email.com Okay, how do you say subject in Spanish? Mm, asunto. Asunto. Exactly, asunto. New products presentation. So, ¿qué es lo que va a hacer usted? Usted va a completar este párrafo ocupando in, on, at. Any questions? No. No? Okay, so how many minutes do you need to complete this task? Um, ¿En cuántos minutos lo termina? Uh, maybe five. Ok. ¿Quieres hacerlo ahorita? And you let me know when you're finished. My email. Yeah. Osmin? My email. No. Ah, ese párrafo tiene unos espacios en blanco. Usted tiene que ponerlo in, on, ah, or okay. at. Depends ah, on, the, on the information. Okay, gracias. Good. Any questions, class? 
preguntas. Are you ready? Yes. I okay. think so. Okay. All right. So let's do it all together. Lo vamos a hacer todos juntos. Jessica, do you have the first answer? Hello, Fatima. Are you busy? Um, on Monday afternoon. On Monday afternoon. Very good. Do you know about the new product that the company launches? There's a presentation about it and it sounds very interesting. It starts at, at 6.30. I work until 5.45, but I can meet you at at six o'clock, at six on the corner of First Avenue and Main Street. What do you think? There is another presentation, but it will be in March. In March? March on Sunday. On Sunday. And I can't that day. Very good. Questions. I, how do you say, no le encuentro sentido a ese pedazo. Which one? But it will be in March on Sunday. Yeah. It will be in March. In March on Sunday. On Sunday. Un domingo. Yeah, un domingo. Como, de, como decir, va a ser en marzo, un domingo. Ajá. Uh -huh. O cae okay. un domingo, por decir así. Ah, okay. okay. Yeah, it will be in March on Sunday. Okay, okay. And I can't that day. All right. Okay. Any questions or comments, class? Preguntas? No? All right. So look here. We have part six. I need a volunteer to read the instructions in part six, please. Volunteer to practice your reading. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Me. Go ahead, please. Using the information from exercise two, page thirty-five. Write write what some of the activity that, that your that your classmates have to, have do. to do. Specify in time time and date. Use okay. Use and to connect your ideas. Excellent. Thank you. Use and. So, using the information from exercise two on page 35. Exercise two on page 45. Do you remember this exercise from yesterday? Okay. It is uh, right what some of the activities that your classmates have to do, specifying time and date. So, no todos estuvimos el día de ayer. Entonces, va a escribir usted Tres, tres oraciones. Por ejemplo, I have a meeting tomorrow at 1 p.m. Or I receive new employees on Monday afternoon. So, escriba tres de sus actividades que debe de hacer durante la semana y ocupando in, on, at. Are we okay? Estamos bien. Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. 
Okay, so please write three sentences. Cuando termine sus oraciones la van a poner en el chat. How do you say attender? Attend. Ahorita mm. se lo pongo en el chat. Thank you. Sure. Attend. You finish, Rose? The date was missing. Okay. <laughs> I only have time. Alright, let's begin. Empecemos con las oraciones que tenemos escribiéndolas en el chat. Okay. I will have a training on Monday, February 15th. Very good. 
I go to work on Friday. On Friday. On Friday. Good. I attend the customer on Sunday. Very good. What else? Uh -huh. A ver los demás. I wake up from Monday to Friday at 5 a.m. Very good. I check emails on Wednesdays. Very good. I was working in the morning. Excellent. Excellent. One more, people. Un ejemplo más. One more. You guys are doing good. I was working in the morning. Uh -huh. I have a meeting on Tuesday at 4.30. Very good. I checked the other department in the afternoon. Very good. ¿Con qué se cierran las oraciones? How do you say punto in English? Period. Excellent. Period. Period. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> Period. Yes. Very good. Y si fuesen preguntas, ¿con qué las cerrarían? Question mark. Exactly. Question mark. Question mark. That is correct. Okay, very good. You guys are doing good. Nice. Alguien más? I leave work at 5 p.m. Excellent. Very good. I've arrived at 6 o'clock. Very good. Excellent. Okay, anybody else? Anybody? Anybody else? Questions or comments? Okay, so let me take attendance. When I mention your name, please activate your camera and write present in the chat. Okay, Vilma Sorto. Present. Okay. Can you activate your camera, Vilma, please? Thank you very much. Janet Morales. Present. Thank you, Janet. Jessica Escamilla. Present. Thank you. Osmin Baides. Present, sir. Thank you very much. And Rosalena Salgado. Present. Very good. Alguien que esté presente y no lo mencioné. Okay, the e, everybody else is absent. All right. So don't forget to put present in the chat. Póngale present en el chat. Así aseguramos doble. All right, very good. Any questions or comments, people? No? Okay, now we go to uh, vocabulary. Work with a partner. One is A and the other one is B. Work with the words from page 37, 38. Unscramble the words and describe them so your partner guesses the name of your department. All right, ¿qué vamos a hacer ahí? Usted tiene que descifrar cuáles son esas tres palabras que están ahí eh, desordenadas, por decir así, con las letras. Are you ready? ¿Están listos? Are you ready? Yes. yes. Ok. Yes. So, descifre cuáles son esas tres palabras. Let's check.
Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Okay. What is number one? Production. 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 And what is the meaning of production? The meaning. Yeah. What is production? Mm. Um, research. Re, research. And identify what customer okay. when in need. No. Okay. No. Pro production. Production. Control, production. Control and supervise the production, workforce, and inventory. Okay. okay. What, what is what is number two? Purchasing. 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 What is the synonym of purchasing? We need to purchase a new television. What is the synonym of purchase? Buy, no, no. Buy, yes, buy. So yeah. let, let me put it buy. in the chat. Yeah, purchase, purchase means buy purchase means buy and what is number three human resource management yes human resources management Manage. okay good any questions on that exercise on exercise one questions questions no only only when the definition what what do they do? Yeah, what do they do? Mm -hmm. So what, what production, pro production uh -huh. has a, in, in production, they have the control. Uh -huh. they, ha they have the control of the inventory. Okay. Well, maybe. Yes, maybe because, you know, like every company is different. Yes. So production is when the real action takes place, you know, production. Oh, okay, okay. So in this moment, I am in a, in a call center. What is the production? What is production? Calls. Huh? The calls? Exactly. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the place where people are taking calls. Okay, okay. okay. All right. Now, who is in charge of purchasing in your company? Who is responsible of purchasing? ¿Quién hace las compras en su compañía? ¿Y qué compra? Ajá. Uh -huh. But is it the manager? Is it the supervisor? Is it the owner? No, there's a department. The sales department. Yes. Okay. No, there is a there is a department. Okay. Uh huh. In, in some companies, le dicen. Ahorita se lo escribo. Acquisition. Uh huh. Acquisition. In, in the government, the government use acquisiciones, no? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, acquisition. All right. Any questions or comments, people? No. So let's go to part two. It says, write six information questions using the WH words provided, then ask them to a friend and write down the information. What, when, where, why, which, and who. Haga una pregunta con cada una de esas palabras y la pregunta tiene que estar relacionada al trabajo de la otra persona. ¿Cómo me va a preguntar a qué horas empiezo a trabajar? What time? What time do? Yeah. What time? What time do, what time you... do I start? Ah, oh, oh. what time do you start to work? Okay. Yes. How do you say cuando es tu día libre? 
we need to... Okay, what's me? Uh, when is your day free? Your free day. When is Don't your free forget. day? Or when is your off day? Off day or day off? Uh, yeah, when is your day off? Yes. Okay. When okay. is your day okay. off? Right. Okay. And then where... Eh, ¿En qué parte de su compañía trabaja? Eh, ¿Por qué está en esa compañía? ¿Cuál departamento prefiere? ¿Quién es su supervisor? O su... So, las preguntas tienen que ir relacionadas al, al, al ¿cómo se llama? Al, al, a su trabajo. Any type of question. Cualquier clase de pregunta. ¿Ready? Ok, let's do it. Escribámoslas, please. Help me. Help me. Osman? Yes. Uh, uh, what is wish? Qual? Uh, number five. Qual. Okay. Qual. Okay. Yes. 
Thank you. Good. ¿Cuál or cuáles? It doesn't matter. It can ah. be cuál or cuáles. Ah, okay. Yeah. Okay. It's your decision if you want to make it singular or plural. Ah, it depends the, the on the noun. The, okay. I finish. Okay. One more minute, class. One more minute. Okay, so when you're ready, please put them in the chat. Put them in the chat. The sentence. Yeah, the sentence, please. Yes. Okay. What do you do? Very good. How do you say what do you do in Spanish? ¿Qué estás haciendo? Not really. No. What yeah. do you do? ¿Cómo te va? <laughs> Not really. No. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? How do you say what do you do in Spanish, Janet? Yes. Um, what do you do dedicas? in the company? Yeah, ¿a qué te dedicas? ¿A qué te dedicas? Uh -huh. What do you yeah. do? I miss, I miss you. <laughs> yeah, what do you do? Si yeah. usted quiere decir, ¿cómo te va? Es, how do you do? Okay. Uh -huh. And what's up is, ¿qué, ¿Qué haces? Onda? ¿Qué onda? Uh -huh. Okay. What is your work? Very good. Who else? Who else? What days do you work? Very good. What else? What else? What time does your work open? Very good. When do you begin to work there? Okay, good. Uh, when is your vacation? When is your vacation? Osmin? When does she attend the customer? Very good. Uh huh. What else? Sigan las enviando, sigan las enviando. Uh, where is the company? Where is the company? So is va antes. Uh, okay, Rose. where is the company? Okay. Yeah, where is the company? Okay. 
um, when do you have a meeting? When do you have a meeting? When do you have a meeting? And then the last one, where do they work? Very good. Where do they work? When did you start in that work? Very good. Solo hay que quitarle la ED. When did you start in that work? Y ponerle el question mark. Why do I like your office? Why do I like your office? Why do you like to work there? Why do you like to work there? So recuerde, cuando van dos verbos unidos, hay que separarlos con el preposition to. Uh -huh. Sing more, sing more. Okay, which days are you free on your work? Very good, very good. Where is your boss? Where is your boss? O oh, si quiere dejar el R, Osmin, tiene que decir, where are your bosses? Bosses. Because R is for plural in this case. So where are your boss? Bosses or where is your boss? Mm -hmm. Very good. Who is your boss? Is it a man or a woman? Is it a man or a woman? I miss it. Exactly. Okay. Yes. Where do you work? Very good, Vilma. Where do you work? Uh -huh. A ver, manden las demás. Why does the production department need help? Excellent. Which is your salary? Very good. Good. What else? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? All right. Any other sentences? Any other questions? Ya casi nos vamos. Ya casi. Which is the computer of the secretary? Very good. What are your activities? Who is, okay, in that case, Osmin, debería decir, what is your position? What is your position? What are your activities? Very good. Why did you choose that profession? Le ponemos el question mark. Excellent, very good. Ya vamos llegando a las cinco y las seis. Who's the new boss? Very good. Excellent. Excellent. Which is the name of your boss? It's correct. Yes. Yeah, it's good. Okay. Which is the name of your boss? Which is the name of your neighbor, your supervisor? Yeah, the question is good. All right, good job. You guys are doing good. Nice, nice. Which is the name of your boss? All right, any other questions, class? You're muted, Rose. Está silenciado su micrófono. Yes. Um, how can I say? ¿Qué tipo? Any, okay. Uh, for, for example, what type of... Uh, quiero preguntar qué tipo de transporte usas para, yeah. para llegar a tu trabajo. 
Okay, you can say type or you can ah, say okay. kind. Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, I, so I what type, having... yeah, so what type of transportation ah, okay. do you use or what kind of transportation do you use? Uh huh. And do you guys remember this word? How do you? How do you commute? How do you commute? ¿Qué le estoy preguntando ahí? ¿Cómo se desplaza usted? How do you commute? How do most Salvadorians commute? How do most Salvadorians commute? La bus. They commute by bus. Yes. Yes. How do most Salvadorians commute? They commute by bus. Mm. Com commute. Commute, yes. They commute. No commute. By bus. Commute. Ah, I was I was reading commute. No, commute. Ah, commute. No yes. commute. Commute, ah. right. Commute. They commute, commute by bus. Okay. So what is the word commute? Desplazarse. Okay, thank you. Yes, yeah, so they commute by bus. So most of Salvadorians, they commute by bus. A smaller number, they commute by car. A smaller number, they commute by taxi. And then we have another number, a smaller number, where you say they commute by motorcycle, right? And some people they Now, nowadays, nowadays, a lot of people commute by motorcycle. Right. There are a lot there of are motorcycles. Many, yes. Yeah, there are a lot of motorcycles right. in the streets. Yeah. Sometimes I commute by car, sometimes by motorcycle. And if the two are not available, then I commute by bus. Okay. They um, commute by airplanes? No. Yeah, but well, in, yeah. In, in cities in the United States, you know, yeah. sometimes they commute by airplane, right? Yeah, cities. By train. By train, by subway. Right, oh, by train, yeah. by subway. Yes, by subway. Exactly. Very good. All right. Good job. Congratulations, class. You guys are doing really good. Okay. And then we go to something similar. So you have three different occupations there two four and six vamos a hacer lo mismo vamos a descifrar cuál es la, la profesión u oficio que está ahí escondido y le damos go ahead
Do you have the answers? I think. What What is number two, Rose? <laughs> number two. Uh -huh. mm, res research and development. The research and development, yes. Okay. And, and what do they do? Uh, could it be found new products? Find new products, research and development. It could mm -hmm. be. Yeah, it could be. How do you say desarrollar? Uh, develop. Ah, oh, develop. Develop new products. No. Yeah, it could be. Mm. Yeah. Or open new departments, maybe. Okay. Okay. Another volunteer. What is number four? Marketing. Marketing. What happens in marketing? They found, how do you say strategy? Strategies. They found a strat, strat, strategies, strategies. Strategies. <laughs> yeah, strategies. strategies. That's correct. They found, they found the strategies to position a new product, you know. Yeah, mm -hmm. to uh, locate ah, or to, to locate. put new products, right? Okay. okay. All right, very good. And what is the last one? Accounting and finance. Accounting and finance. What happens in accounting and finance? What do they do? I put, uh, they invest the money to make the company grow up. Okay, yeah, they invest yes. the money to make the company grow up. That's a possibility, okay. yes. Okay, could be. Okay. okay. ¿Qué más hace contabilidad? How do you say planilla in English? Payroll. Payroll, yes. yes. I, for, I don't forget. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> How do you say descuentos? Descuento del banco, del AFP, del seguro. Oh my God. No. It's not discount. No, no, it's not discount. <laughs> A ver, who helps Rosa? Can I use that Rose? Let me see my D. Discount. No. Not no. exactly. D dog. Deductions. Deductions. Very good. Yeah. Deduction. <laughs> Deduction. Yeah, yes, yes. Okay, Deduction. so we have discount. Okay. Deduction. Versus deduction. Yes. In our boleta de pago, how, how do you say boleta de pago? Pay stop. Okay. It say deductions. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Pay stop. Pay stop is the paper that they give you. Where they say, tanto le depositamos, menos ah, esto, menos esto. That's a, yeah. Pay stop. Ah, okay. Pay stop. Yeah, the deductions uh, no son necesariamente las deducciones de ley porque puede ser un banco que un le banco, está... Uh -huh. Ok, un préstamo. Ya, yeah, un préstamo o, o le están descontando oh, cualquier... Oh, exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. Okay. Okay. So that's a deduction. Uh -huh. Now, what are the official deductions in El Salvador? Is AFP. Ajá. Uh -huh. um, um, renta. How do you say renta in English? Taxes. Ah, taxes, taxes. Right, right. Okay, people, any questions about uh, about the vocabulary section? No? I think, I think that uh, putting in practice what I do, what I do. Yeah. I, I feel, I feel so difficult because the vocabulary, uh, I, sometimes I, I was, uh, you're I looking was thinking, for, uh -huh. yes, I was looking for the words. Uh -huh. I, I don't know how do you say, uh, ingresar compras al sistema. Right. Uh, o hacer traslado de mercadería. Yeah, y, y todo eso, 
todos deben de saberlo. Todos, su misión debe ser saber decir a qué se dedica usted en su lugar. Uh -huh. Porque todos vienen de diferentes departamentos. Uh -huh. Finance, marketing, uh, tech support. We have to know very uh, or much, no, what do you say? We have to know much a, lot. a lot of vocabulary about our position. Exactly. Exactly. Financial accounting uh -huh. and the warehouse. Exactly. Uh -huh. y, y no solamente lo que hace, sino con las herramientas uh -huh. que usted lo hace. Yes. Es decir, si usted va a su escritorio y mira a su How alrededor. Do say, uh -huh. How do you say sistema? System. System. Uh -huh. Okay. A system. Uh -huh. So, uh, tiene que saber cómo se dice engrapadora, okay. pompón, uh -huh. regla, plumones, todo lo que está con lo que usted se, des se desempeña. Okay. All right. Any questions or comments, people? Ok, vamos a la última actividad. Nos quedan como 6, 7 minutos. Es question 4. Volunteer to read instructions, please. Volunteer that wants to practice reading. Ok, question and preposition of time say, interview a, a partner about this or her activities on a typical day and world is in information, question, questions, and repositions of time. Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Osmin. So, okay. en los próximos cinco o seis minutos, voy a poner a trabajar en pareja, y usted le va a preguntar a su compañero, what do you do in the morning? What do you do in the afternoon? What do you do in the evening? So, recuerde, para decir evening, la segunda E es muda, no se pronuncia, no es evening, sino que es evening, evening. So, let me do this here. Recreate, recreate, move, Osmin with Rose. Move to room three. Move to room three. Okay. And right there. Let's do this. Simple questions like, what do you do in the morning? What do you do in the morning, in the afternoon?
Uh -huh, for example. And in the evening, teacher, I left the work. <laughs> no. Yeah, it, I returned to my house in the evening. Ah, okay. I returned to my house in the evening about uh, 6 p.m. You finish at 6 p.m.? Yes, I finish at 6 p.m. Good. I was talking with Janet and I, I, I tell, tell, say. I told her? I told her. Uh -huh. in, the, in the morning, in the morning, the first thing that I do is a print, printing, printing? Yeah, print. Print, uh, remission notes, because the technicians are waiting uh, to take out the merchandise and they need the paper, then right. the remission note, yeah? Right, right. But, but it's the first thing that I do in the morning, but sometimes I do the same in the afternoon because uh, someone, maybe a vendedor. Salesperson? Um, maybe a salesperson need another remission to take out. Uh, another. Right, right. Yes. It's not a strict, a strictly, strictly. Yes, yeah, strictly. Yeah. Okay. It's not. Strict. Okay. In the morning, I I do this. Okay. I do the same in the afternoon. All right. Good. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's return to the main session class. Okay. Okay, we're waiting for Osmin and Vilma. Vilma, Vilma, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, I know that maybe you didn't finish the activity. Tal vez no lograron terminarlo. Les agradezco mucho el que hayan uh, dedicado dos horas de su tiempo una vez más. Thank you very much. Uh, terminamos la próxima semana. We have five more sessions. Y pues les agradezco mucho por su tiempo. See you Monday. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice weekend. See you Monday. Have bye a bye. Nice weekend. Bye bye. 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 bye.